What's up guys, it's Pop Thicker. Today we're going to be going pop on for the um, Walgreens Horror Fogo Pops. Um, I called the other day. They said they have them, so yeah, it's pretty good. They put them on hold for me, so we'll go pick them up in Austin last week. Maybe we can pull out some chases, but um, yeah, let's see. Um, this should be good. Oh, oh shit, he's, he's so stupid. Yo, review. Let's hope they get it. Hope they get it. Oh yeah, we can pray, we can pray. There they are guys, we found them. This is also the only other one they have, they have the um, Jason Voorhees. Yeah, um, I don't think they got the chase, but I would be killed to have that chase. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty sick. Ah. <sighs> Fuck the Funko Shop, yes guys. Um, it was fun to shop today. I, I, you know, I'm gonna show you what it was. I, I only wanted one thing. One thing. It's okay, cute. I love you. My little dogs are here, so. Yeah. Don't put my Claire in here. Oh, good dogs. Alright. <coughs> Here's the good news. Um, hmm. I also told my um, mom, I also told my mom to um, try to get some for me in the Funko shop too, in case we would freaking fail, and, yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm looking far. Sorry. Sorry, there's also a mess. No. There was also a Mezco toy drop today, so I got on that. I don't know if I should film a video about it. I mean, I think it's still available, so it was really no shit show. But, yeah, so this is the shop today. It said, it said Funko Shop Animation Drop. What did it have two per customer? Yeah, I was pretty stupid. Sorry, that was my text. I know I'm, I'm terrible. I'm sorry, I'm sweaty. I just got back from my school, from my dad's school, doing some basketball and stuff. But yeah, that's what they had. They had a... We practically knew all about these, so it really wasn't no shocker. Uh, there was the, um, the Stitch on Tricycle, a Diamond Hello Kitty Pop, and there was a Bullseye a as Alien, and there was a art series, an art series Bugs Bunny. See, here's the thing. I had three electronics. My dad was going on his um, his school his school thing, and he said we shouldn't be going on this. But I tried, and fuck, I missed it. But my mom was also on it too, cause she knows this shit is ridiculous. And yeah, she got one for me. So yeah, I'm pretty stoked about that. That's pretty freaking awesome. So I was able to get the one I want when my mom got it. My dad and me missed out. It sucks because freaking my friend shut down like two in like one minute because he used a certain pay app. And I tell my dad, if we want to get lucky, we need to use this. And I, he's still saying, like, I, I, I don't know. He said he doesn't want to do it, but I'm hoping we can do it because that's the only way we're going to get lucky now. Fungo Shop is like the fucking lottery. You enter and it's like it's a race to, it's a race to try to cash in. But yeah. What I want to go over is that the um a the um freaking alien or the Hello Kitty one was limited to four thousand pieces. No one knew. No one didn't even want it until they heard it was four thousand. They just whoop bought it all up. Hmm. So yeah. So literally, um, Bugs Bunny sold up first. Then it was a tricycle. Then it was the Hello Kitty and Bullseye still available. So yeah. You can kind of see how it's successful. But um yeah. Anyway, today we're gonna be reviewing the Walgreens Horror Pops for twenty twenty this year. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so the first up we have is we have the Walgreens exclusive Vampire Jack. Now this one um is kind of um damaged. Um I actually got these um a while ago. I just had to post a video. I just couldn't post a video due to like some reasons. But um yeah, we're gonna pop them out of the box and show you guys. Cause I know we all like our going to dark pops. <laughs> yeah. He is pretty cool. He does feel pretty smooth, I'd say almost. He almost has like that glow in the dark touch to it. Which is pretty cool, but yeah, uh, smells like plastic. 
Now here's the thing. Um, I actually found these at a different Walgreens, like, like maybe 16 miles away. So yeah, they had one set in, so I bought them. My dad also won a second of the Invisible Man, and we found it at a different Walgreens, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's how it looks. These have not hit the site, but once they hit the site, I'm guessing they're going to sell out very fast. Yeah, it's just crazy with some pops. Like, people are telling me, you got to harass the Walgreens of workers to get on my bullshit, and I got to do that. Yeah, but on the back, you get Vampire Jack, the Witch, Mummy Boy, and... The Andresa Gale, I don't know. Hmm. He's number 598 hmm. at a pop Disney. Disney, Vampire Jack, Glow in the Dark, Walgreens exclusive. That's pretty cool. And if you're wondering, I bought all of them. It's a yearly routine. <laughs> Next one we have, well, this actually, there's only one new sculpt I think they did. The others are just repaints slash variants. Well, I guess you could also consider one of them to be a new repaint, or I mean a new sculpt. But yeah, that's him. So yeah, he's also he was also he's also a variant. Then we have the glow in the dark Frankenstein, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Um, I do like it. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I like the the glow. The only glow in it is the flower, which is also pretty cool. But yeah, he's number six oh seven out of the pop movies, the Universal Monsters. There's side of the box. Those guys can get on the back. These are all vaulted, if you are wondering. So yeah, they're gone. <laughs> yeah, there's that. There's that too. Um, on the back, you can get Dracula, Frankenstein, the Bride of Frankenstein, the Wolfman, the Mummy, and the Creature the Black and Blue. It's okay, guys. Yeah, those ones you can get. I'll show them to you guys. Hmm. Pretty cool. If I had the old ones, I would have compared them, but they're somewhere in my bedroom with all my pops. I don't know where they are. But yeah, he's pretty sick. Pretty sweet. Hmm. So yeah, what's practically different about this one is it just glows in the dark. Really nothing new. Yeah. Alright guys, the next one, this is one of the ones you can consider a new sculpt. It is... The um, the Walgreens exclusive black and white Invisible Man number six oh eight out of the Pop Movies Universal Monsters line. On the back, you can get Dracula, Frankenstein, the Bride of Frankenstein, the Wolfman, the Mummy, and the Creature from the Black Lagoon. Those are the ones you can always get. But yeah, what's actually pretty different about this guy is he, in the old Pop they made, he had a test tube, but this one has a book in his hand and it's black and white. So yeah, so does that mean they're gonna make more black and white pops? Never know. But yeah. He has a book in his hand, so that makes it new. It sucks that it's just a plain book, like they should have put the name, the name of a book on it. But yeah, the glasses are kind of metallic which is cool. Man, yeah, this is a very, very, very cool pop. I'm happy I got to add it to my Invisible Man set. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's a Walgreens exclusive now. Um, the Walgreens is for all my um, followers who are from Windsor Locks, who follow my YouTube channel. Um, if you want to get any of these, you sadly cannot. Oh, well, in our area, because they have sold out of them all. But, yeah, the last one I have, um, yeah, they sold out. I called earlier today asking about a different pops they were getting. They said they didn't have it, but they said they sold out of all the um, horror pops. But, yeah, so the last one we have, this is the new skull. This is the um, Dave Acula pop from the Minions. The um, Illumination Presents the Minions. This is the Halloween one. I think this movie is supposed to come out. Well, there's a new one coming out, I think, Minions 2 or 3. I don't know. I know it got pushed back because of COVID, but yeah, that's how it looks. Pretty cool pop. That was the side of the box, the window, where you can see the other detail on it. Back of the box. There's a matter of Clara. Oh. And there's that, the side art, and there's the back, and the front. On the back, you get the mummy, um, Stuart, the creature Mel, the Franken Bob, and the bride Kevin. This is one number 966 out of pop movies. Um, Illumination Minions, um, Dave Acula. So yeah, let's pop this out of the box. He's actually kind of a heavy figure. I was very happy when, um, I heard my Walgreens got them in, so I was like, let's go. <laughs> but yeah, that's how it looks. Pretty cool, I like his pose. He's like, ha, ah, like that. Almost like what a vampire would do. But yeah, pretty cool. He's got a couple weight to him. He's kind of a little heavy. But yeah, those are his free fingers. Back of the cape. Other side, in the front of him, and his hair. 
Hmm. But yeah, very cool pop. Um, these haven't actually hit the website yet. They will soon, I think. I've heard they're coming. Well, I heard like two weeks ago they're coming soon, but I think they could be coming very soon, just around the corner. So make sure you get um, ready on the site. If you follow this pops on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, you can stay up to date with him. He'll post when they go live. But yeah, guys, that's going to wrap it up for the Walgreens Horror Pops of um, 2020. Comment below what your favorite was from this year and which one you were able to get. But yes, guys, I will catch you later. Bye, guys.